Hello friends, I Kalpana Dipan, Assistant Professor in Bayani Girls College, welcomes you on the behalf of GuruKPO.com. Today I am going to deliver a lecture on the difference between the Western Ghat and the Eastern Ghat. This is the peninsular India. The Western margin is called the Western Ghats and the Eastern margin is called the Eastern Ghat. The Western Ghat is a parallel to the West Coastal Plain from Tapi River to Kanyakumari. And the Eastern Ghat is parallel to the East Coastal Plain from Odisha to Nilgiri Hills. The average elevation of the Western Ghat 900 to 1100 meters and the average elevation of Eastern Ghat is 600 meters. The average width of Western Ghat is varying from 50 to 80 kilometers and the width, average width of Eastern Ghat is 100 meet kilometers. It is a continuous chain and Eastern Ghat is, a, is in the form of broken lines because the so many rivers uh, broke its continuity. The Western Ghat has a structural uni uni unity but in the, Western, in the Eastern Ghat the structural unity is lacking. East, Western Ghat is the perpendicular from the southwest monsoon that's why causing the occurring a great rainfall over the west coastal plain and the eastern ghat is almost parallel to the eastern monsoon occurring the low rainfall in the east coastal plain. Thank you, thank you and thank you for visiting my video. For more details please log on to gurukpo.com.